is you can jump your shoulder over. <laughs> so, 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 Oh, you jump out, straight in the shoulder jump. So let's imagine that I'm fighting this guy I've seen that, right? Bam! Then I can smash it. So you can get used to not just always going for the face because you might trade. And we don't want to trade. So if we feel that something is coming this way, bam! Blast it straight in. And bear in mind, a bit like a double jab or a double cross, bam! Bam! You can fire it right into that shoulder socket and right into his face. That makes sense? So I just want you to have a quick go. I want your partner to try and belt you around the head. And what you want you to do, jam that into the shoulder. Same type of course stroke. And then keep it going. Keep the offense going into his face. Make sense? You don't know what this is. You know, in a melee, the reason why we typically go this way is that this is my typical strong hand against the most likely person's strong hand. People's strong hand is typically where they carry their best weapon. If you carry a knife, you want to access it with your strong hand. If you carry a back, you want to carry it with your strong hand. Your best punch, if you're not trained, is probably with your strong hand. So you might as well hedge your bets on that. So I just want you to get used to the notion of stop it and then jam it. Make sense? The guy that's swinging starts slow and eventually put a bit of weight on it. And if you don't do this well, you will get slapped. Capish? Yeah. Good luck.